doesn't have to be recorded. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get my position right. Okay, go. This is funny. So again, thanks everybody for a, a great day, really. Um, very empowering day, no pun intended. Um, just powerful speakers all along. As I said, I am Lisa L. Baker. I'm the founder of Ascentum, which is an award-winning coaching practice. And I am the creator of Grow Finances. Grow Finances is a four-week course that is designed to help you jumpstart your journey to financial freedom. Each week of Grow corresponds to the letters. The first week is about getting out of debt. The second week is about retaining more of your income because it doesn't matter necessarily how much you make. What's more important is how much you're able to keep of what you're making. And then we talk in the third week about how you organize and protect the assets that you will start to build in this process. And last but not least, we get to the W, which is winning and is all about walking in wealth so that you can live, give, and leave a legacy. So sign up. For grow it starts in april make me look good by signing up uh otherwise it's not going to look good if we don't have any signups and it's teachable.ascentum ascentum.teachable.com i will drop the link in um the chat again for those who have it and it, it listen it may not be for you at this time but it may be for someone else there are so many people in this country in fact over 60 percent who are living paycheck to paycheck many of us are burdened by debt so if that's you if that's your story or if you just want to get a good solid financial education to understand how money works and even more importantly how to make it work for you then you may want to consider grow finances you can follow me on LinkedIn, subscribe, all the things. I'll put the information in the chat, but thank you, Elizabeth, for the opportunity to just share that. And um, congratulations and thank you to everyone who has been on and done such an amazing job today. Yes. And so I just quickly say thank you to all our sponsors. Brenda is here, Linda, uh, Linda uh, Lisa is here, and Linda Thompson is here. And uh, thank you for sponsoring we had a lot of sponsors, so let me just run the list and I hope I don't miss anyone. So Colonel Donna Ford, thank you from uh, Mutual of Omaha, Brit Fix, which is an importer and a store in Goldsboro, uh, Avon, uh, Jean Martin, thank you so much. Um, and then we have, uh, let me see on my list, um, Angela um, Clemens uh, with Color Street, Priscilla Wilson, uh, and everybody who sponsored, if I missed you, I apologize. And so I am very honored to have a, a U.S. Uh, Army veteran uh, who has been uh, with me from day one. Uh, and we don't get to see each other because when we both started, we had a lot of time. We used to talk to each other every day. And now we're so busy that and so I think God did that, uh, Nicole. I think God I did that because he laid the foundation for yes. today. So it doesn't matter if we don't speak or we don't communicate because we had that time. That was our time where we talked every day, two or three times a day. And you know, yes. we, had, we had the time, but now yes. our businesses have launched and we're very busy now. So this, this works, we, we've had our time. So, um, and now this is our time and this is our moment yes. again. So I would like you to close us out and then Elton will bring us into prayer and then we'll close the event. Anyone that I missed? Okay, over to you. Um, so first I wanna say, just piggyback off what Lisa said, this has been more than I could ever process. The amount of notes that I've taken, the amount of times I had to close my camera to run somebody down on LinkedIn and connect with them or Instagram, um, it has been overwhelming. I am, my, my soul is full, my heart is, is full. I absolutely believe it's been said three or four times about um, divine intervention and divine connection. And, and this day was set aside for this purpose. So I absolutely um, believe it. My name is Nicole Peel. I am the founder of Jean Peel's Luxurious Collection. I am an artist and soap maker. Um, as of today, two orders today while we were on this conference, I've taught 250 women in nine countries how to make soap. Um, I am on this journey that soap making is 
one, um, a portion of the women that I taught are women veterans who have gone through military sexual assault, who have gone through PTSD. Soap making is therapeutic and it's therapeutic for them. Um, for women who don't want a soap business, but want an all natural, keep pointing the wrong way, an all natural product that's handmade for their family. They want to make the bath and body products for their family. So I also, um, I also teach them and Oline, um, I make all of my soaps with aloe vera juice. Um, we love making soaps with aloe vera juice. It is amazing on your, on your skin. So, um, so that's me. That's who I am. I know we'll get more into me and soap making as I get back into Elizabeth's circle. One thing that I will say that um, is the hill I run up and die on. Dove is not a soap. Please stop using Dove. It's not a soap. It's a synthetic detergent. So I'll let that go. When people say I use Dove because I have sensitive skin, honey, it's not a soap. Um, so we'll talk about all of that and then how to just um, get into the space of getting smarter about what you use on your on your skin. Um, so again, I am thankful. I'm humbled and I'm I'm grateful, Elizabeth, to be here. Um, anytime, call me. Like I said, the winds have changed. Retirement is good. Relocating is is great. Call me anytime. I will always always come. Thank you, everybody. Well, All thank right. you for thank being you. a wonderful chair, mm -hmm. and uh, we appreciate you. We value you. Send me your new address so we can send you an official thank you. And uh, over to you, LT. Whoa! Been a really amazing day. Really amazing day. I can see the look on your faces. It's been a fatiguing day. What a day it has been, though. You all have been so remarkable, so incredible. You, which speaks of how incredible and remarkable you are. Uh, we have we celebrate you continually. We we continue to celebrate you. This has been a celebration. We've come to the point of finding ourselves and the power in me, empowering us. We thank you all for participating. Uh, I'm just, it's incredible. So, but uh, as we close this out, uh, this is the fourth annual Women's Day Empowerment Conference. And uh, this will go in the books uh, and we're getting ready for you all to have an amazing year, an amazing year. We're counting on it. And so let us pray. Uh, thank you, kind Father, for your grace and everlasting mercy. We ask for uh, grace and mercy for each person under the sound of my voice and who has stand and stood and uh, been a part of our program today. We thank you for the victories. We claim the victories and we give your name the glory and all that we do. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Bless the Lord, our Father. Dear Lord, continue to be with us and protect us. Give us good health. And those that are standing in need of prayer that need favor, give them favor. And we thank you right now. In your holy, righteous name, we pray. Amen. amen. Say amen. 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 Thank you. Thank amen. You. amen.